Three out of the last four winners of the Tour de Romandie have gone on to win the Tour de France. It's a great indicator of form and progress over the year. Stage two is the first mountain test between the very, very big riders in this road to the Tour de France, and for some, the Giro d'Italia. That's where we're headed, all the way from Moudon up to Morjan today. The third ever stage finish here, three categorized climbs, and a final first category all the way to the summit finish. Céline, Impi, Beppo, De Ghent, Vis and Venter. Six-man break that went away in the first 10 kilometers of the stage today. A real problem for Chris Froome. Well, here we go. How many pro bike riders does it take to change a front wheel? Froome with a front wheel puncture, and I think that was Mikel Nieve who was helping him. Just 20 seconds now for Cillian, Impi and Vis. That's to the peloton. You can see Pierre Alain still being taxied up to this group by Joe Dombrowski. The race leader on the left-hand side, Yonis Aguirre. And Geraint Thomas, He's looking on his quite own. isolated already. He is isolated. He's on his own there. This is a disaster for Team Sky in what is, in the last few years, been their race, hasn't it? Being dropped here. So, Impey is the only man able to go with Pierre Alain as he goes on the attack. First of the big favourites to make the move, Pierre Alain of Canada. Yep. Remains so here and here goes Naido Quintana. Quintana then to launch the attack with his teammates still in the group behind. And we were wondering how long it would take before Naido Man would start his ascent towards the top. And look at this from Ino Zakarin. Well, he came into form this time last year. Took a stage at his first ever Giro d'Italia after he took the overall general classification here. Quintana, left-hand side, Zachary as it kicks up now, Quintana goes again. There's a right-hand turn to go before it levels out with 100 metres to go. Quintana cannot drop him though, and this is Zachary waiting, ready to come round and go for it in the sprint. Quintana on the left-hand side, Zachary on the right, it's stage two of the Tour de Romandy. The Russian hits the front, Zachary is going to take the stage win. Zachary is there, Quintana second, unhappy about the Russian maybe crossing his line a little. And Ricochta fighting it up for some bonus seconds as well. There is the Portuguese former world champion. Just behind him, Rigoberto Uran. Good ride too from Thibaut Pino. There has been a change. Nairo Quintana is the stage winner ahead of Inu Zakarin. So relegation into second place from Zakarin for coming across the line. And that means Quintana is the man who takes the yellow jersey. The updated overall general classification looks uh, a lot brighter for Nairo Quintana. 18 seconds after Inu Zakarin is uh, classified, declassified down into second place.